Hey, so I finally got my SL Miss Glam order in the mail yesterday, which I had waited for a month. And I am so, so excited that it is finally here and I cannot wait to open it with you. Because I don't have my mom or my dad anymore. I'm like just watching her with her kids. It's just so sweet. They're like her little princesses and I don't know. I feel like I, I enjoy that and I, watch, I enjoy watching her making her little espresso coffee drinks and showing her office and her home and business trips and other travel vlogs. Today is Wednesday, April 19th. Yesterday was Tuesday, April 18th. I got the order yesterday, April 18th. The order was delayed because they ran out of that collection too. I got the black glam one and neutral eyeshadow palette. And I really wanted that. And the other one, the pink one that she just got restocked, it looks like, because she was presenting it last night on her Instagram. And she might be doing another giveaway. And I'm really hoping I got that. So anyway, to make it up to me, <laughs> She said she was going to add some extra goodies or goodie in here. I don't know what, but we're about to see. I wanted to let you know that I put on my um, Maracuja oil face serum from Tarte and my Dr. Brandt Pore Refiner Primer because I was like, I know I'm going to use these brushes. I don't, know, I'm not I don't really brush much anymore except when I'm doing like blush and bronzer and my eyes maybe. Highlighter with that. But like, I don't usually use brushes much anymore because I don't like the brush strokes. But I did watch her and this was what led me to want to buy this brush collection was she did the same thing a few years ago. It was, I think it was at least a year or two ago when she came out with this album, or album, <laughs> brush collection. I don't know what the hell I'm thinking about music. It's in my head. But uh, yeah, she used it and I was like, and she was saying how they don't do that. So, and watching her on her video, I'm like, yeah, I don't really see that. So, I don't see the brushes, the brush marks on her face. So, I'm going to do pretty much the same thing on a whim. See how they apply. I think I might do my eyes first because I'm not really an eye kind of gal. Like, I'm not good at it. But I figured we'll play with the colors. I don't think I'm going to do swatches for a change. I'm just going to probably try every color and see how it goes and then I'll do my face and see how they go and see what else she gave me and check out these brushes normally like I even said to her on her Instagram recently I was like her brushes are the best like aesthetically um there's the brushes themselves are so soft and they feel so nice on your skin like they're the best the funny thing is this box is like overly stuffed the way that I would do my boxes like without showing my address isn't this funny? Yes, I was looking so forward to it. I still am. That's all Miss Glam. This thing. Okay, I cut it. I didn't even open open it yet, but I cut it. You know, I'd be able to get this open easier with you, but I gotta cut it some more. So I'm guessing this is one of my goodies. Brush I got. It looks like a Valentine's Day themed brush. This is my goodie. It's so pretty. It's an ink. It says SL Miss Glam Angled Blush. Blush? Really? GB01. I never used blush this small before, but why not? I'm like a little blush. And then this looks like the palette. Wow. I don't even. I only ordered two things, I swear. And there's four things in there, I think. Tis. Oh, these sound good. The eyeshadow palette, and it's the natural glam, which are like what I consider neutral shades. SL Miss Glam Beauty Natural Glam Eyeshadow Palette. I think I'm gonna cry. I'm just so excited. Like, it's been a month. <laughs> and I'm finally trying these. They're cruelty free and vegan. It's good for a year. And I figured I don't have a lot of neutral shades. I mean, I have, but not really. Um, and I'm trying to rebuild my collection again because I just got rid of a lot. But it says eyeshadow, macaroon. These are the colors. Cookie, sugar, milkshake, sweet, chocolate, honey, mocha, tea. And we're going to have to look at the ingredients. And her, she's based in Los Angeles, California. But I know she lives in somewhere in Canada. Natural glam. So these are the eyeshadows. 
This is so cute. Okay, so there are pinks in here too. This one's kind of pinkish. Cause I like pinks, just like she does. Not because she does, but like I do like pinks. But these are good too. It's gonna be fun to play with. So cute. It's like a nice little compact. You get like this protective sheet and luckily nothing is broken. Everything looks good. That's like her little logo here. I don't know if you can see that. Kind of like embossed SL. SLM with a queen, a heart, I don't know. The crown it looks like. Is that what that is? I can't tell. So we have one, two, three, four, four shimmer shades and one, two, three, four, five, um, what do you call them? Matte shades. Um, this one you could probably use as a highlight or like a transition shade. Or this one maybe, or that one. And then like, if I do how to do eyeshadow, you could like use this or this to smoke it out, which I don't know how to do. This too. Oh, this is gonna be fun. And before I get into bed, I wanna see what else I got in here. I'm so excited. So, what's this? Oh my God, she gave me her blenders. SL Miss Glam Trio Sponge Set. I'll have to look at it and then I'll let you know. And it says on the back of here, SL Miss Glam Pro Blending Sponges that are the perfect tools you need to evenly blend cream and liquid foundation for a smooth and seamless look. We also have the perfect stand included for your beauty sponge to stay looking pretty. Oh, I want a stand. I don't have one yet. Dampen your sponge to create an effortless blend or use it dry for complete coverage. You can use the pointed ends for the delicate eye area while the rounded sides be, while the rounded slides blend out larger areas of the face. And a women-owned business, hell yeah. 100% vegan, not tested on animals, yes. And this is like nice and sealed up. Latex free, hypoallergenic, and use damp or dry. I like to do a damp. Just a little damp. I don't want to open it. It's so nice. And um, I'm going to lose my way for now. I have my little brush brush, and I believe this is the black lamb palette. This is really nice, so very fancy. Yes. 15 pieces black glam set. How do you get it open? I don't know. Yeah, this is just so nice. Wow. Funny, it was very aesthetic. I don't wear like a black glam shirt. Okay. So this is how it comes, very fancy. SL Miss Glam, Black Glam brush set, 15 pieces, 100% vegan, not tested on animals, so it's cruelty free, really pretty. I just wanna say part of my hair, I'm getting it done, I'm supposed to get it done next week, but um, so yeah, my highlights are like growing out real fast. And so I'm um, about to open this up. I just washed my hands, even though I'm gonna be using the brushes. And I need something to open this up. I just probably scratched it, I think. Yeah, with my scissors. Don't do what I did. Oh, I hate when it happens. It's still really pretty. And so I'm about to open this up. That was corny. But yeah, <laughs> so there's 15 brushes in here. I don't know if I'm going to use all of them, but I'm going to try to. Smaller brushes. All about that base. About that base. No trouble. All right, so I'm going to grab some foundation. And I'm going to go with. I don't want to use them yet. Aren't they pretty? They're like black. With what? With a silver or gold specks, and then the brushes, the bristles are like white. Really like glam. I need like a whole other cup of this. 
I'm gonna like dump these in here. And they have like a little netting on them. I keep them nice and safe. I need to find the foundation brush. Um, I was a foundation brush, which would I do? This one. Oh, I see. Expert face. It's on the um foundation. Oh my god, I was right. It's on the gold part. I knew I saw them. For a girl that doesn't want to I'm pretty good. I'm gonna get rid of these brushes. So aren't these so pretty? It is so pretty. So this is the Pro found because we're pros today. We're being pros today. Pro Foundation BG04. What does the BG stand for? I don't know. So I'm gonna use some of this, my Tarte Face Tape Foundation in shade 27B. And I'm gonna apply this on my face like so. Oh, I forgot. I didn't want to do the foundation first. All right. After the foundation, I'm going to do my eyes. Because I don't do concealer after that. Oopsie. I'm going to put some foundation on my eyes, too. Just to give them a little base. Again, I'm not a makeup artist. I'm not an expert. I'm just me. And I do like the way it's applying so far. Wash them, you know. I'm bringing beauty back. I don't know if those are the words. It's probably not. But we're gonna make them. The words. Uh, I'm doing my makeup just to do the grill. I got some uh, smoked kielbasa, kielbasa from the German butcher shop right on the corner of my house. And, uh, and I have some grilled vegetables, grilled peppers to have on this one. So I wanted to take, take a look. In all honesty, and I'm not just saying this, I really prefer this brush for my foundation and I'm not just saying it Stephanie Miss Glam you than a beauty blender or any other brush I've ever used before which is why I want to know how good does this brush wear after all the wear and tear of you washing it and stuff because I am in love with this brush like for real all right so so I can play with my eyes we're gonna find a little brush here that I can powder them a little just to set them before I play with your eyeshadows. Is this one? I think, yeah, be be Fluffy Eye Blender BG15. You said in your video, you're like me, we're like, you don't really do things with the right tool. I don't know. You might be like me, we're like, you just pick whichever. So we're going to do it. We'll see. I'm just doing a little Anastasia Beverly Hills. Just a little. Maybe a lot. Oopsies. Oh, I got it on my sock. All oh, about that base. About that base. You gotta hold it a little far away or else you're going heavy. I got a space here on my table. I just want to put a little bit of a base. I'm only doing the concealer second just in case there's fallout, but I don't know. I didn't really see it when she did it, so. I'm trusting you, girl. Trusting you, girl. All right, that was a little sloppy, but it's okay. A little sloppy here. All right, so now we're gonna... Do this. 
that's not the right brush brush for this type of situation but it's okay go in with oh they are named cookie no i have to use the other one no i'll use that one first cook 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 cookie this like beige-ish one here up here in the middle if it was a tic-tac-toe board it would be this one tap it off i can't do my eyes without making that funny face that i just made all about that face about that face no trouble i'm bringing beauty back There's no way in hell I'm going to make my eyes the same, so just to let you know. I don't want to do that. I'm not a pal. Tap it, tap it, tap it. I need to look in my other mirror because this one's dirty and dusty. I can't see that. Between that and my glasses, it's not being All right, so that's very soft. But that's what we wanted. I'm going to go with this orangey one. Chocolate. Cho no, it's not chocolate. Um, milkshake brings my boys to the yard and they're like, I think that's milkshake. Or is that that one, the milkshake? I don't know. I feel like it's usually backwards. That one says chocolate, the orange one, but I don't think that's true. The orange one, this one, I don't think that's true. I think your palette's dyslexic, not to be offensive. I think it's opposite day here. Opposite day. And then I'm going to try not to go too hard on that. And do the crease too. We're just gonna build this till I got a blending brush in the crease, kind of. <sighs> My milkshake brings in the boys. <laughs> I'm being silly now. Oh, what are you doing, silly? I was a little too hyper today. I don't know why. But it's like why? No, hold my back here. It's a squirrel. I thought there was. I thought somebody was in my backyard. I thought Daniel was inside talking to his daughter. Yeah, because she's busy. You can just knock on the open door. All about that base. About that base. Nice. Yeah, it's like a nice soft look. All right, so now we're going to go deeper with this one here. Deeper. It's a little too deep. If you ask me. <laughs> all right that one over there i believe is called mocha the ones in the middle are easier to tell because they're in the middle and you can't mess that up i don't think deepa it's not really called deepa right no it's mocha <laughs> i'm like what the hell see i'm telling you i'm silly i'm in a silly mood i just like the monster i feel like i'm doing like a funky punky look i'm not on purpose Stuff. Who would have told you your doing your makeup is like punky funky, funky punk. <laughs> it's a funky punky look. I'm totally sober right now, just so you know. I'm seriously in a silly mood. I don't know how to do my makeup, just so you know. I'm just having fun because that's what girls want to do. Whatever I did on my right eye, I gotta try to repeat on my left eye, but I don't know how to do makeup, so good luck with that, huh? Alright, so, yeah, this side's definitely more pronounced, unless it's the lighting. Black glam, that's what we're gonna try to do today. Alright, so, before I tap the hell out of this, who's next? I'm gonna switch brushes. Alright, so, oh shoot, I just poked the other brush. You have one in here that's like a little more precise. What's this for? Is it this one? Or is it this one? No, that's a little too. I actually want to get. Now I'm gonna use my bottle of water and pray I don't drop it up. This one is the Small Eye Blending BG08 brush. Well, I'm trying not to break your palette. So what I'm going to try to do is... I need a better light here. Jesus Christ. 
All right, so we're gonna go in with, I'm trying to go like light to dark, and I was gonna use this color here, this like lightest, lightest one, either here and there or both, we'll see. But first we're using the deep ones. The solid, solids, I guess you'd say, deeper. All right, so I just tapped that a little bit in the middle one here on the bottom. Did I just use that one? Mocha? Shoot, I forgot. Yes. All right, so I'm going to try to make that one go away. <laughs> I'm trying to blend it out. Deeper. All right, so we're going to go in with this chocolate one that I think is chocolate, not milkshake. That brings my the voice in my arm. That one there. I'm getting into everything. Deep. Jeepers creepers. Oh my god, I can't. Doing it in here. I know this isn't good for people with small eyes or hooded eyes, but we're gonna do it anyway. Because tonight all bets are off. Alright. Going back in with what I think is chocolate. Is this one again here? I'm not giving the finger, I swear. So I can't do it when they're making that weird ass face. Oopsies, I said a bad word. Alright, so now. We're done with all of those except for the latest one, and I feel like um, doing something fun with the foily shimmer shades. So I'm gonna swing brushes again. I'm use my fingers, but we're also gonna use this brush, these brushes, because that's what I got them for. So we're gonna use this other one that feels kind of dense and small and kind of precise. We're gonna do something fun. This one is the brow, oh, I'm going to do the brow bone first. The brow bone highlight BG because we have to. The one that I actually got the brown in, the chocolate. This little guy here with the beautiful um, emblem in it or logo, which is called T or Honey. I'm going to tap it out. You know this one, the beautiful one, the extra beautiful one. I do the rest of my makeup. Okay. Oh, I have to do my brows too. I'm gonna try not to. Do that. I kind of want to put this shimmery one in there too. That shimmery one in the middle there, like smack dab in the middle. Stuck in the middle with you. That was a little too crazy. Why did I do that? Joker in your hat. No, 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 no. I love the words. Stuck in the middle with you. I thought it was going on really heavy, but in my bad lighting, my bad lit dark room, it's not so bad. All right, so now I'm going to. Are there any other little ones like that? I don't know that one. Boots? You okay? Yeah, I'm doing my face. Oh, you're just doing your face? Right. Yeah, I'm making a video. Oh, sorry. That's okay, Boots. I'm just not making videos. Like... I know. Uh, I'm talking to myself. <laughs> All right, so now I'm gonna go in with this one because we did all the sh uh, the solid ones, the mats, tea or honey. I think this is honey, to be honest. This one right here, yeah. it's kind of like a champagne, but I don't know what you call it. <sighs> Mac dab. Oh my god, I don't know what to do with this. On my eyelid with this. I don't know if I'm gonna change it or what, but we're gonna go in with the eye on the eyelid with this color. Although I feel like I should be using my finger. Cause I feel like that makes it more, you know, it gives it more oomph when you're using these um shimmer shades. But I don't mind it. I didn't really tap it out very good. Why am I whispering? Oh yeah, because I'm talking to myself again. 
talking to myself. I'm dancing with myself. It's talking to myself. Whoa. I need more views. Nobody likes me. I don't know why. <laughs> No, I'm more in these self-deprecating lines. So I don't know if it's the brush or what, or maybe me or my mirror, but it kind of looks kind of like, what's, oh, there's no mirror. Um, what's the word? Word of the day. Oh my God, that mirror is freaking disgusting. Blotchy, like the stuff on my eyelid, but we'll see. Use another one. So we're going to go in with, we're going to like do multicolors. This one up here, the pinky one, this other pinky one with the same brush called Macaroon, I think. Macaron, Macaroon. It's one of them. I gotta do this without making that face. I'm trying to do the, the outside half, if that's possible. No. All right. So stuff. I just want to say I could be wrong about that one. That one looks really pretty on my hand. So what I wanted to say is there's no fallout. <laughs> That's what I wanted to say. I might go in more with like one of the browns again later, but um, I'm going to go in with this one that reminds me of Halloween. The shimmery orangey one up here, which I think is sugar. Or is it that one? I don't know. Whichever one this is. This orangey one. I'm like an outer V, or at least I'm trying to, because I'm not very good at that around like, you know, the outer areas in my other mirror. But I'm trying to show you what I was kind of doing. Show you what I was kind of doing. I think. Oh, like this. with the shimmery orange and then I'm gonna go in with uh what did I not touch it oh this one this one in the middle okay this little guy in the middle which I think is sweet I almost wish I didn't get this one dirty because I want to do it in the there maybe Oh, that's pretty. That would be a nice highlight somewhere. Probably can't see it. Is this one sweet? This pink one here in the middle? I'm sorry, I'm not giving you the finger on purpose to say go up yourself. I'm gonna do it there because that's where my finger went. Smack dab in the middle with you. <laughs> hmm. I'm gonna put it in the middle. I don't want to blowing it. It's not really going anywhere besides my blur. I will give you props, girl, for really, 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 really stay put eyeshadows. I have like minimal fallout, and I don't know if this line underneath here is from the makeup or if that's from me, but it looks like it's probably from me. And there's a little bit of glitter like right in the corner here, but that's probably from me too. But hold on. I'm going to throw this in there a little just to like give it some contrast. Okay. I look like a clown. That's okay. I look really pretty. When it's all done and together, it'll probably look a lot nicer. So now we're going to switch gears because I'm pretty sure I used all of these colors. And I'm going to go in looking for something to use. Oh, my concealer. We're going to conceal some of this. We're going to try to conceal some of this. Contour? No, we're not ready for that yet. Um, flat brush. I don't know what that's for. Precise. This is probably what we need for. Precise face. That sounds like concealer. Oh, is this one? I don't want to get the makeup on it. This concealer that I used over the weekend from it's the Creaseless Concealer from Tarte in shade, which might be a little too light, but it's fine. 13N Fair Light Neutral. 
with the Precise Face BG03 brush from SML, SL Miss Glam. Alright, so. Oh my freaking mouth. There it goes again. There it goes. There it goes again. Where did I put stuff on that? How about I get on there? I look like a weirdo. I don't feel like I need the concealer because the blood, um, the foundation brush was awesome. I don't know what to do. I still see my wrinkles, but I mean, nothing I can do that's gonna make it go away. And I'm frowning. So let's see. This might not be a brush for concealer, but we'll do it anyway. Don't ask why I did that. Oh, it's an onion. Ever notice when you make a video doing your makeup, it takes like a lot longer. 12,000 times the time. And it's so hard when you can't see yourself. I'm about to switch gears. I may say, and I do. <laughs> it was really scary. I'm never using any other makeup brushes again. Besides these, for like, especially for like the face stuff. Wow, girl. All right, so let me get some of this. We're gonna set the face. The Anastasia Beverly Hills. Okay. Oh, that was on my fan. I'm gonna knock it or something. And I might switch brushes. Blush, maybe. That's another eye brush. Powder. Fan powder. That's where we're going to go. Fan powder BG13. Just powdering both sides. <sighs> Trying to do like this area. I'll do it like this. And my neck, because why not? I put foundation there. Okay. All about that face, about that face. No trouble. I'm doing mostly my own. My fine entire face. Okay. Will I get powder on my shirt? Okay. So now, I got like foundation on it too. We are going to. Video is 30 minutes long. Watch bronzer. We're gonna use this light one today from Tarte. The Shape Tape Glow Bronzer in I don't know. I think it's the lightest one. To be honest, whatever that one is, that's what this is. It's the lightest one. And that's all you need to know. All right, angled contour BG. I don't know BG stand for that. I don't remember. BG02. Did I tell you I'm not an expert? I'm not an expert. Oh, there it is. I found the angle. <sighs> Fan it out. We're reading our faces to the gods. Well, mine. Gods, who are you? <sighs> I'm both hands for this. Yeah, you have to make those faces when you're doing makeup. So light, I can't really see it. 
In fact, tell you the waiting here is really good. Alright, so I, if I did it, I, I, I'm telling you now. I don't really have much of a double chin anymore because I lost weight. $60. But we'll do it anyway. Because we want that snatched look. You know, when you're snatched. Alright, let me do my nose. Oh, I'm going to use this one. Hopefully it's not like a fanning brush. Let me look at my face first. Alright, so that's good to go. I'm going to use the other little brush. So there's no more little brushes left. But I'm not, I'm not going to be using every single brush today. I'm sorry, Steph. There's just so many. I don't know what else to do with that. I have ideas. So this one is another little fan, a uh, little uh, brush. This one is the eyeshadow BG14. And you know what we're using it for? My nose. Ta-da. I don't know why I said ta-da, but I did. All right, so... I want to make it a little more narrower if I can. I don't know. Maybe a little bit more. A little more narrower. Uh oh, I got it right down the middle. I didn't want to do that. Hold oh, on, it's so plain. It's so light that like it doesn't it's hard to like mess it up like in the dark shadow in this area it looks kind of dark but like out there it's not so dark it's, like right over here in my mirror my big mirror so that's that now i'm going to do my brows before i forget them we cannot forget the brows i got the maybelline express brow gel the other day at ShopRite. i got the clear one and i got this other one in black brown 262 at ShopRite because it's, that was the darkest they had. I saw the floor by accident. The clear one, was, it's all right, but I don't know about this one. One of my aunts thinks I should do my brows blonder or like a taupe to match my highlights. And I'm like, mm, I don't know. Because my natural hair, to be honest, my natural hair, my brows were always darker than my hair my head. Like this hair. So I don't know about that. I just don't. This is alright. I can't tell what it looks like till I apply it, but this brush is very precise. I need to reuse the mirror for this. I'll be right back. Overall, with the exception of the little, <laughs> I keep scaring you, the, <laughs> the little spot that I left on my eye area, I actually like this better than other ones I've tried lately. Yeah, so I would recommend this one. Um, the shade I'm not sure about. I don't have anything wrong. There's nothing wrong with it necessarily. I like darker, but it's not bad. The darkest one they had at ShopRite. Black brown. It's the Maybelline Work Brow Fast Sculpt Gel Mascara, and the clear one's good too. You want to do like a no color. You don't want any color on your face that day. You just want to go clear. Anora's orgasm. We're gonna have an orgasm. How about that with Mars? All right, so, so I don't know why I just said that. All right, so I'm gonna use the blush brush, flat brush, flat, no, I can't speak, flat blush BG10. All right, they're so pretty. I love that little, like the rhinestones. They're so pretty, all of her brushes. I think are like that. You know I'm not playing a little too much on there because I am playing. This is very like punk rock chick. Okay. I don't have done that. But I do anyway. So I'm add a little more on the right because I feel like the left is more on the right. All right, because you want to look like you just had an orgasm. When you use an orgasm, orgasm you do. So you know I'm not making it up. All right, so 
so that's that. And then I still have to do my highlight. This one of these in a long time, and it's never too late. So I'm gonna use this fan brush, the fan BG09 brush. Brushes, I did not use five of them. I'll show you which ones because we should not miss them too much. So this is the Fenty Beauty by Rihanna. How many carats? A oh, woman never tells. Her all over Diamond Veil highlighter and the shade is called Diamond Bomb from San Francisco. Just gonna go crazy tonight because I don't do that anymore. This is like the best highlighter. <laughs> Ever. Anywhere. My lids. I love doing my lids because it makes it go like sparkle. Shine bright like a diamond. -na 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 -na. We're going to do the OG highlighting. -na 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 -na. -na -na -na. We're like diamonds in the sky. Shine bright like a diamond. Oh. I didn't mess that up too much. <laughs> I look crazy on the chin because we're going like we used to. We're like diamonds in the sky. Okay. <laughs> I keep scaring you like that, don't I? Alright, so now I'm going to do my... I'm going to spray myself. <laughs> it sounds so gross. I'm going to put some stuff trying to spray. And... Move it. I like to move it, move it. We like to move it. Dun, 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 dun. All right, we're gonna use the all nighter because we're gonna go all night. Urban Decay all nighter. Not really. I wish I had somewhere to go besides the grill. I have a date with the grill tonight. We're gonna make some sausage kielbasa. Have yeah, a sausage party. I don't know. Urban Decay all nighter. Shake it like a pole in a little bitch. You know what to do. Daniel's probably watching me. No, he's actually not paying any attention to me. Okay. My baby dog mats around because she's Oh, I can myself. So I'm gonna need another card. Oh. I'm gonna say hello to the ones I didn't use. Hello, the ones I didn't use. So this one, if I can read it, is the Expert Face Brush BG01. Here it is. Here it is. And then I have these four. And this one is the Angle. Angled Blush BL06. Then we have this one, which is the fat, fat oh Jesus Christ, the flat face BG07 brush. And then I have another littler one, which looks like an eyeshadow brush. The tapered eye BG1. And last but not least, the tapered powder BG05 brush. I love how these are all packaged. So we're going to say goodnight to these. We didn't use them, but we will eventually. Next time I do my makeup, I'll probably try to make a point to use these. I'm going to do my lips first before I do my photos and my mascara. Lips. Tarte. Again. Tarte Maracuja Juicy Lipstick in Shade Cherry. That's cherry. It doesn't crease around here, I don't know. But if you if you know, let me know. I look like I'm going on a hot date. And I'm not, I'm just going to my grill. Date to the grill with a date, if to, a trip to the grill is literally hot. So I guess that could be a hot date. <laughs> so yeah, let me do my, my um, 
mascara. So the Lancome Edel Lash Mascara is what I was wearing on Sunday, in case you were wondering. If you weren't, I'm going to tell you anyway. This is what I was wearing. My cousin asked me what I was wearing because she loved it. My cousin Michelle, she loved that picture. So she's like, what are you wearing? Lancome Edel. Look in the mirror. Is the finished look almost finished? This is B. Sorry, my hair is a bit of a mess. So this is me. I hope you enjoyed this, and um, I will see you all later. I'm sorry, my hair is a mess. Thanks for stopping. Hi. Thanks for stopping by. Let me find a better angle. Thanks for stopping by. I know my hair is a bit of a mess. I apologize. I'm just turn around and see if the ladies play this way. Yeah, kind of. This is me. She's turning my videos this way. I am in the dark. But here it's brighter. Sorry about the socks. I'm about to have a hot date with the grill. If you like this video, please give it a thumb up. Don't mind the band-aids. Thumb up and comment below. Do you know I saw Miss Glam? Miss Thing? And do you watch her videos? Have you tried her brushes too? Aren't they awesome? I was outside. Uh, and uh, don't forget to subscribe before you leave. How do you order this crazy? But other than that, like, that's me. Uh, I need to I'll be 40 in the end of the year. Talk to you later. Bye.